everyone! Today I've got your Rio 2 movie review. It's jungle out there. For a family of blue macaws who are just trying to survive in the wild where humans take over and Rio, Jewel, and their three kids have to fly to safety. Now, I was anxiously waiting for this movie to be released. One reason is because I saw the first Rio movie and it was probably one of the best animated movies I had seen at the time. Uh, when it came out, and I usually am skeptical when it comes to certain animated movies. Trust me, I love all those Disney movies. And I'm a huge fan of that animation, and I'd have to say that Blue Sky Studios has a huge track record for giving us some of the best and well-known animated movies. Uh, like the upcoming Peanuts movie. I can't wait for that. So Anne Hathaway and Jesse Eisenberg are just a few of the many voices that return to this film. And they are better than ever. This time around, uh-oh, Rio is going to be in quite the predicament when he comes face-to-face, beak-to-beak rather, with Jules' father, voiced by, uh, by Andy Garcia, who I think plays a pretty convincing bad guy daddy. I mean, he's not the only intimidating character, an intimidating bird out there. In the first Rio movie, we had a character um, that comes back for this sequel called Nigel, played by Jemaine Clement, who's had his fair share of voicing characters in animated movies. Nice singing voice, by the way. The colors in this film, of course, once again, just really blew me away. They were so amazing, and I think more movies, especially animated movies, should take this route. I know not a, I don't know how many people actually appreciate um, these huge, bright, vibrant colors just popping out on screen. Maybe only those prefer watching it in 3D, but I really just love it. I think it really just exceeds the imagination and it really immerses me, especially in the movies. And I think that this is a movie that the whole family will love. It shouldn't just be known as a kid's movie, and, you know, parents can also go see this movie and like it too. I know, even though I'm not a kid, um, I can still see movies like this because it's just so fun, and it's energetic, and especially with the music. It just makes me want to see this movie again and again because it looks really cool. Next time, I will see this in 3D. But the one thing that I think that really worried me about this movie was that I wasn't too sure it was going to be as good as the first one. I know a lot of movies, especially sequels, get a lot of flack for um, everybody's anticipating it to surpass its, you know, first movie. It's supposed to be, like, two times better in scale. It's supposed to have that it factor that, you know, the first movie didn't have. And I would say that, um, it did own up to the first real movie. I think it was pretty nice. From the first opening musical segment, uh, to Kristen Chenoweth's recognizable voice as this pink frog, and she was just having her Broadway moment in this movie, so I thought it was really nice to see her there, um, which totally fit her character very well. The soundtrack overall was not as great as the first movie. I'm still jamming to that Esther Dean song. The soundtrack overall was not as great or as memorable as the one from the first Rio movie, but Bruno Mars might have just changed all that uh, a couple times. Yep. I can't believe he was in this movie, too. The overall feeling I had about Rio 2 was that it was great, um, and as, as far as an animated movie goes, um, though I don't think it was good enough to surpass just how awesome the first movie was. I mean, I remember when it first came out and I was just super excited to see it. This one, I mean, I was definitely excited to see this too, but maybe not as much. I was more hoping for it to be better than the sec uh, better than the first real movie. And it did have some excellent scenes, um, as well as some great chemistry with the cast members, especially Anne Hathaway and Jesse Eisenberg, um, who at first I didn't think could pull off 
being in an animated movie, especially Jesse Eisenberg. I don't think I've ever seen him play any characters. Neither in Hathaway either, but that's okay. And I think their roles came out to be pretty decent. If you were a fan of the first Rio movie, then definitely check out Rio 2. And how does this movie compare to the first movie or any other animated movies you might have seen? Let me know which movie and also let me know in the comments what you guys thought of Rio 2. I could remember who was your favorite character in this movie. As always, you guys can subscribe to my channel. I've got more movie reviews, movie updates, coming up week for a Thursday video. You guys can also like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter, and I'll see you guys later.